Video 3 of uh, the project. That's a model cardboard thingy that I've done up for what the base will be. Um, so, not, you know, too big. It's pretty portable. Um, there's obviously a topic to go on that, but I won't actually play it with the monitor and return on buying the real thing for the time being um, to see how the buttons work out. That's a control panel I've settled on for the time being. Um, 20 cent piece coin insert to the left, which is just a switch. Uh, bank of four top control panel buttons, um, joystick, and which isn't really don't see there. And six buttons for the main controls. The only other point is off to the right. I'm going to have a volume control, which is drawing with pencil at the moment, because I don't actually have a speaker system yet. Um, the black square there. Is going to be a power button. That's going to be a green lighted button. Um, so when that is hit, so the power turns on to the device. Uh, that should actually draw power from the power supply. It'll turn green, which means on. And the coin thing over here will light up red. So um, I'm going to have two lit up buttons, which should look pretty cool. We've got a barrel lock here, which is actually going to be switch B. Uh, that's going to probably be my main menu and a few other things. Um, so that when. Um, I don't even need to access it. I can just um, grab the key, I'm just floating around somewhere, and sort of go, and that'll be the menu, um, so that no one else can get into it except for me, which is just a control freak thing, but I like having stuff like that. Um, inside the case is going to be along these lines, although I'm going to get rid of the for our Facebooks obviously at some point. Um, the motherboard's going to sit there, PS is going to sit there, there's a fan at the back of it, going to have a fan down here, drawing in, probably, and a fan at the back out that way, drawing out. Um, cables will be internal, and the control panel here is obviously going to be wired up, um, but that will probably be where the buttons will be, and I'll come to my pack up here. Um, so that's pretty much how I'm looking at the moment. I'm going to hook this up to the monitor and play some games and just get a feel for it. Um, then probably just not to put the top bit on the flap. Obviously, we won't be able to get the monitor in it, but this cardboard's actually um, thick enough to withstand a beating at the moment, so I'm going to actually play it for a bit. Funnily enough, after the last video, I actually uh, forgot to get around to showing the top bit, and I figure I might as well show the whole hinge action while I'm at it. That's what the box should look like folded up. Looks m mildly, I don't know, imposing, probably here. Um, so for scale, I have a Crown Lager at hand. So it doesn't look quite as big now, um, hopefully. Depends on how you're looking. I'm looking on a smaller C screen at the moment on the camera. Um, that's basically what I'm looking at. Not so sure where the control panel is going to go yet, but I'm going to be putting on the front here, um, obviously, along here, like a carry handle um, with some clips, just so clip this um, down. This, the idea is, will move up like that, and we'll have the monitor. Um, there are speakers up top with the subwoofer hopefully and the control panel down here and that's is all protected by uh, the beveling here uh, so there's a nice flank area so it's closed down you can sort of move around belt it around obviously want to slow like that um, and it'll be protected <coughs> um, this is actually quite a lot later in development than when I actually posted the first video I just kind of forgot to add this part 